46 years old. I left Israel, I was 36. I had a chance. Every time there is a court date, it's like, okay, maybe this time. You know, I have gone through so much money and really gotten nowhere with the rabbinical courts. It puts so much turmoil and emotional stress, and it's like a roller coaster. My mom would hide it from, she would try hiding it from us, the pain. You know, my friends, their parents were divorced, and you know, they would struggle with their parents remarrying. But with us, we tell them, I wish my mom could remarry. I wish my mom could be happy. To have your daughter come over to you and say, why should I marry a Jew to be in the same situation as you are, it's terrible. Will this happen to me? Do I ever want to get married? Some days I would be like, you know, I know I'm Jewish, but why just not have a live-in boyfriend? Because at least I'll be able to be free. And many times I told my lawyer, go to them with that. Go to the rabbis with, do they know what they're doing to my children? It's not enough what he's doing to my children, but do they know that they are accomplices and backing destroying my children? Oh, my God. Oh, my God.